I'm Richard Tynan from Sturgeon College Ross Gray in County Tipperary. My project is advanced modelling and infilling algorithms for 3D printing. When you're printing 3D parts, most of the time you don't need to uh, print them completely solidly. Um, it's a waste of time and material. So most people choose to print them uh, not hollow because hollow is too weak, so they choose to print them with kind of a support structure on the inside. Um, so my project's about kind of finding what would be the optimal support structure to put on the inside of a model. You know, can we make more complicated but more efficient and stronger support structures for the inside? Well, I've always been obsessed with kind of making things come from the virtual to physical world. So I started 3D printing about a year ago. Uh, just around the time of last year's exhibit, I was um, ordering the parts to build my printer. Um, so my printer had its first print in March last year. Um, and then I sort of, as I was using it, I sort of realized, you know, there's a lot of kind of software behind this that could be developed more. Um, and before the summer this year, I decided um, I was going to see if I could make infills better. And that's where the project came from. The findings were that a lot of the infills uh, performed a lot better than the ones that are currently available. So the ones that are currently available are sort of um, 2D patterns that are extruded upwards throughout the model. Um, so my infills are a lot more kind of complicated, they're 3D in their nature, but they tend to support the object more evenly throughout and use, um, or get, get a lot more strength for the amount of plastic they use. I hope to kind of um, integrate it better in the software that's currently used for 3D printing, make them more efficient, better, easier to use on more complicated models.